Hello everyone. Well, I was going to do another uh, episode of City Skylines uh, Lostville, but the game is just crashing on startup. Uh, I've been having way too much trouble with uh, City Skylines crashing, so quite frankly, uh, until Paradox can fix this garbage, uh, or not Paradox, Colossal Order can fix the garbage, uh, I'm not going to be doing any more uh, City Skylines uh, videos. Uh, now, I was going to uh, do a video, uh, one more part in the Lostville series, but, you know, it, uh, uh, it was getting a little bit boring anyway, but, uh, you know, so I was going to uh, lay off, maybe do an episode here or there, but given the uh and crashiness the fact that i can't even get the game to start half the time or three quarters of the time uh like the uh the save loads and then as soon as i unpause it it crashes uh but uh occasionally uh if the phases of the moon and uh, the day of the week and uh uh you know, the uh, state of the great red spot on Jupiter lineup or something like that, uh, it will stay running long enough to uh, record an episode. Um, and I just, I just can't deal with that. It's, uh, it's just too, you know, it's just too, uh, you know, I think, I think, uh, you know, fill in your own, uh, own adjectives there. Uh, so, uh, I figured instead of just uh, you know stopping the series uh, cold, I'd give you a, a bit of a commentary on uh, on the problem. Now, I'm still debating whether I'm going to replace uh, City Skylines uh, with another game. Um, I've got a couple others that uh, I want to make a series on. Uh, both of them are early access titles. Uh, one is uh, uh, Workers and Resources, Soviet Republic. It is definitely uh, early early access, uh, alpha quality, but it's quite playable. Um, I've been uh, playing around with it. I've got to the point where I think I can uh, at least make a go of it credibly on a, uh, on a uh, Let's Play series. So... Uh, uh, I'm pondering that one, uh, and another one which hasn't quite got to Steam early access yet is uh, Voxel Tycoon, and that one uh, is also um, uh, definitely uh, early access, but it's definitely playable as well. It's missing a couple of uh, key features, and I was kind of hoping I could hold off on uh, a uh, gameplay uh, series on it until they got at least passenger transport into it but they haven't yet uh, that one's going to be a little bit like um, transport fever 2 but uh, it's also got a uh, uh, another uh, dimension to it in that you uh, basically uh, have goods manufacturing uh, that you have to maintain yourself so uh, that uh, that could be uh, entertaining to uh, mess around with uh, as well. Uh, I'll probably end up doing both of those at some point. I'm just not entirely certain uh, which one I want to uh, replace uh, City Skylines with. Now, uh, hopefully the stability of St City Skylines gets uh, fixed in uh, upcoming releases. It's not clear to me whether the crashiness is due to uh, the garbage launcher stuff that uh, Paradox has inflicted on it, or if it's down to just bad coding on the part of Colossal Order. I mean, the game's always had the odd crashiness issue, uh, where uh, you know occasionally you'd have to reboot your system in order for it to just work. Uh, so I think it's doing something uh, definitely hinky when it comes to the um, the graphics. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's where the hinkiness is. Uh, and uh, quite frankly, uh, that indicates bugs in the graphics drivers as well. But uh, given that the game has been uh, 
It's been getting more and more complicated as the DLCs come along and the uh, expansions. Uh, you know, I have all of them, but it, you know, and they do add a dimension to the game that is, uh, you know, quite, um, quite interesting. Uh, they've clearly not uh, concentrated on making the thing bloody work. Now, it might partially be down to the mods I'm using. Uh, maybe my system is no longer up to scratch for running the game, but that doesn't feel like that's the case because when it works, it's working smoothly. So, yeah, it's uh, basically it's too much, too difficult to get a uh, to get the game running stably in order to uh, to make an episode. So, uh, you know, like I might continue to mess around, uh, you know, off camera with uh, games, but uh, but quite frankly, uh, with the difficulty to get anything recorded. It's not worth the effort, and you know I I really hope that uh, that paradox and colossal order can uh, you know take their collective heads out of their collective asses and uh, put some effort into stability uh, instead of just uh, more expansion to the game. Uh, anyway. Uh, you know, that's basically the rant on City Skylines for now. Uh, as I said, I just wanted to make sure that everybody knew why I was stopping it. Uh, you know, as I said, also, I was going to pause it anyway. Uh, basically, nobody watches the uh, Skylines videos anyway. But uh, if you've uh, encountered these in the back catalog, now you know why they stopped. Uh, I'm leaving them. I'm leaving the existing videos up, of course. Uh, they at least give you a reasonable uh, example of how to get started with a city. Uh, if you uh, follow through to the point where I stop the series, uh, you'll see that the city is actually uh, viable. So, uh, so there's that at least. Um, anyway, uh, I guess. Uh, uh, I'll see you back in a week uh, with whatever I uh, drop into this uh, time slot. Uh, it's probably going to be Voxel Tycoon or Workers and Resources, but I'm not entirely sure. Uh, I may just drop in an extra episode of Ostrev or something like that uh, for the next couple of weeks. Um, yeah, uh, but really... Uh, there, there isn't anything else to say on this, so I guess uh, see you back tomorrow with the usual uh, uh, Transport Fever 2 episode uh, and next week for whatever the fill-in is. Well, that's all for now.